Muskogee, Oklahoma. Muskogee is a city in and the county seat of Muskogee County, Oklahoma, United States. Home to Bacon College, it lies approximately 48 miles southeast of Tulsa. The population of the city was 39,223 as of the 2010 census, a 2.4% increase from 38,310 at the 2000 census, making it the 11th largest city in Oklahoma. The 1951 film Jim Thorpe, All American, starring Burt Lancaster, was filmed on the campus of Bacone Indian College at Muskogee. Three feature films were recently shot in Muskogee Salvation, 2007, Denison, 2010, and American Honey, 2016. French fur traders were believed to have established a temporary village near the future Muskogee in 1806. But the first permanent European American settlement was established in 1817 on the south bank of the Verdigris River, north of present day Muskogee. After the passage of the Indian Removal Act of 1830 under President Andrew Jackson, the Muskogee Creek Indians were one of the five civilized tribes forced out of the American Southeast to Indian Territory. They were accompanied by their slaves to this area. The Indian Agency, a two story stone building, was built here in Muskogee. It was a site for meetings among the leaders of the five civilized tribes. Today it serves as a museum. At the top of what is known as Agency Hill, it is with an Honor Heights Park on the west side of Muskogee. In 1872, the Missouri Kansas Texas Railroad was extended to the area. A federal court was established in Muskogee in 1889, around the same time that Congress opened portions of Indian Territory to non native settlers via land rushes. The city was incorporated on March 19, 1898. Ohio native Charles N. Haskell moved to the city in March 1901. He was instrumental in building on the land rush, he stimulated expansion of the city of more than 4,000 people to a center of business and industry by 1910, with a population of more than 25,000 inhabitants. Haskell built the first five-story business block in Oklahoma Territory, he built and owned 14 brick buildings in the city. Most importantly, he organized and built most of the railroads running into the city, which connected it to other markets and centers of population, stimulating its business and retail, and attracting new residents. As Muskogee's economic and business importance grew, so did its political power. In the years before the territory was admitted as a state, the five civilized tribes continued to work on alternatives to keep some independence from European Americans. They met together August 21. 1905 to propose the state of Sequoia, to be controlled by Native Americans. They met in Muskogee to draft its constitution, planning to have Muskogee serve as the state's capital. The proposal was vetoed by U.S. President Theodore Roosevelt and mostly ignored by Congress. The proposed state of Sequoia was never authorized. The U.S. admitted the state of Oklahoma to the Union on November 16, 1907 as the 46th state. Muskogee attracted national and international attention when, in May 2008, voters elected John Tyler Hammonds as mayor. 19 years old at the time of his election, Hammonds is among the youngest mayors in American history. Muskogee is an economic center for eastern Oklahoma and operates the port of Muskogee on the Arkansas River, which is accessible from the Gulf of Mexico. According to the United States Census Bureau, the city has a total area of, of which is land and, 3.69%, is water. Muskogee is near the confluence of the Arkansas River, Verdigris River, and Grand River. Historically, the area around this confluence has been called Three Rivers. It is served by U.S. Route 62, U.S. Route 64, U.S. Route 69, Oklahoma State Highway 16, Oklahoma State Highway 165, Oklahoma State Highway 351 and the Muskogee Turnpike. Muskogee lies in the Arkansas River Valley and has a low, sea level elevation compared to much of the rest of the state. The city is on the boundary of the Oak and Hickory Forest region of eastern Oklahoma and the Prairie, Great Plains region of northeastern Oklahoma. It is a suburban community of Tulsa. The city's climate is considerably warmer and more humid than other parts of the state. These data were accessed through the WRCC and were compiled over the years 1905 to 2016. The record high occurred in August 1936, and the record low in 1905. As of the census of 2000, there were 38,310 people, 15,523 households, and 9,950 families residing in the city. The population density was 1,026.0 people per square mile, 
396.1 per square kilometer. There were 17,517 housing units at an average density of 469.1 per square mile, 181.1 per square kilometer. The racial makeup of the city was 61.12% white, 17.90% African American, 12.34% Native American, 0.90% Asian, 0.02% Pacific Islander. 1.57% from other races, and 6.16% from two or more races. Hispanic or Latino of any race were 3.28% of the population. There were 15,523 households out of which 29.3% had children under the age of 18 living with him, 45.2% were married couples living together, 15.4% had a female householder with no husband present, and 35.9% were non-families. 31.8% of all households were made up of individuals and 14.8% had someone living alone who was 65 years of age or older. The average household size was 2.39 and the average family size was 3.00. In the city the population was spread out with 25.7% under the age of 18, 9.7% from 18 to 24, 25.8% from 25 to 44. 21.4% from 45 to 64, and 17.4% who were 65 years of age or older. The median age was 37 years. For every 100 females, there were 88.8 males. For every 100 females age 18 and over, there were 83.4 males. The median income for a household in the city was $26,418, and the median income for a family was $33,358. Males had a median income of $28,153 versus $20,341 for females. The per capita income for the city was $15,351. About 14.6% of families and 19.2% of the population were below the poverty line, including 25.9% of those under age 18 and 14.3% of those age 65 or over. Muskogee is home to Honor Heights Park, a World War I memorial park, notable for its azaleas and the annual azalea festival held each April. During the winter, people from across all 50 states travel to Muskogee to see Honor Heights transformed into the Garden of Lights, a Christmas lights display. Muskogee has six museums. The Five Civilized Tribes Museum preserves the art and culture of the Five Civilized Tribes. The USS Batfish and War Memorial Park's major attraction is the submarine USS Batfish. The Three Rivers Museum chronicles the history of the Three Rivers area and the railroads that helped create it. The Oklahoma Music Hall of Fame has been honoring Oklahoma musicians since 1997. The Thomas Foreman Historic Home is an 1898 farmhouse preserved with the furnishings of the Indian Territory Judge John R. Thomas and his daughter and son in law Grant and Carolyn Foreman, Oklahoma historians and authors. The Ataloa Lodge is on the campus of Bacone College. Two feature films were recently shot in Muskogee through a tax incentive program offered by the state Salvation, 2007 and Denison, 2010. Writer and director J. A. Steele produced both films. Muskogee is home to the Castle of Muskogee. The castle hosts 4th of July fireworks sales, a Halloween festival haunted castle, a drive through Christmas Kingdom and indoor castle Christmas experience, and the Oklahoma Renaissance Festival, founded in 1995. The Renaissance Festival draws in tens of thousands each year, hosting jousts, dancing, vendors and other events. At the center of Muskogee's flourishing art scene is Muskogee Little Theater, MLT. MLT was established in 1972 from the unused Sequoia Elementary School. The theater puts on up to eight shows per year, including youth theater, senior theater, holiday shows, and general community productions. The theater is also committed to education and development arts programs, including youth theater camp, voice lessons, mentorships, weekend workshops, and more. The City of Muskogee Foundation provides grants to community organizations and nonprofit groups throughout the Muskogee community. Muskogee is governed by a council manager form of municipal government. The city manager is the administrative leader of the government and is appointed to be the city council. The city ceremonial head is the mayor, who is a voting, at large member of the council with limited administrative power. The current city manager, Mike Miller, and mayor is Bob Coburn. The city is divided into four wards, with two members of the city council elected from each. 
Each member of the council is elected by the city as a whole but must reside in the ward he or she represents. Elections are held on the first Tuesday in April in each even-numbered year. All elections are nonpartisan. The mayor and the members of the city council receive no salary or compensation for their services. Muskogee is represented by two state representatives, State Representative Avery Fricks representing House District 13 and State Representative George Fott representing House District 14. District 13 includes the west side of Muskogee while District 14 includes the east half of Muskogee. The city is represented in the state senate by State Senator Dwayne Pemberton, R. Muskogee, in Senate District 9, which includes all of Muskogee County, Oklahoma. Both former Attorney General of Oklahoma Drew Edmondson and former Oklahoma Superintendent of Public Instruction Sandy Garrett are Muskogee natives. The city is part of Oklahoma's 2nd Congressional District, represented by U.S. Representative Mark Way Mullen, R. Muskogee. The city is also home to U.S. Senator Tom Coburn. Since 1995, crime rate has risen by 45 percent in Muskogee. According to records by the Oklahoma State Bureau of Investigation, in 2002, 2008 and 2009, no murders were committed for the entire year. However, on April 10, 2010, a deadly shooting broke out at the Arrowhead Mall injuring at least five people and leaving one dead. Witnesses say that the shooting was gang-related. There are two primary public school districts in the city of Muskogee, Muskogee Public Schools, which include the vast majority of the city limits and a large portion of Muskogee County and Hilldale Public Schools, which covers a small southern portion of the city limits in some parts of the county south of Muskogee. Additional smaller school districts serve the smaller communities of Muskogee County. Notably, Muskogee is the location of the Oklahoma School for the Blind, a special institution for meeting the educational needs of blind and visually impaired students residing in the state of Oklahoma. Muskogee is home to four institutions of higher education the public four-year Northeastern State University, the public two-year Connors State College, the public Indian Capital Technology Center and the private four-year Bacon College, which is the oldest college in the state of Oklahoma. Thanks for watching. Don't forget like the video and don't forget to subscribe.